next chief minister of Karnataka, Siddharamaya, there uh, stating that once the government comes into power, then all the guarantees, the promises made by the Congress will be delivered. But what a spectacular election. It's been, uh, viewers, we've been getting you the latest, but all leads in of 224 seats. Uh, most of them have been called, and this is what the political chessboard looks like, and the Congress is going to be spectacularly happy. Let's get you the vote share first. Uh, the BJP has retained its vote share of 2018, standing at 36%. The Congress, 43%, has gone up from 38 to 43%. The JDS at 14%, fallen 4%. Others at 7%, uh, fallen 1% there. This is the vote share of what it looks like. And when you convert it into seats, what does the Vidhan Soda look like right now when it comes down to Karnataka. In terms of seat share, the vote share translates into a whopping 137 seats for the Congress party where the Bharatiya Janata Party, even though it has exactly the same vote share of 2018, it's come down to 63 seats. 63 seats from 104 in 2018 with exactly the same vote share. Then you have uh, the JDS that is now at uh, 20 seats. It was 37, a spectacular downfall for the JDS and others standing at just four. So this is uh, what... Uh... All right, let's cut across right now to KC Gopal. He's from Karnataka. Listen it. This is a clear message. We, we stood for poor people of Karnataka. They stood for rich people. Finally, poor people won this election. This is the clear narrative of this election. No, this is, this is this actually this is the this is one of the milestone of the 224 election. Okay. That you Congress person is doing a PC. See Venu Gopal, who's uh, from Karnataka, from the Congress Party, and uh, Randeep Singh Surjewala. He has been camping in Karnataka. Uh, pictures of both of them feeding each other sweets were released, but Randeep Singh Surjewala not wanting to say anything. The task cut out for the Congress. Who will be the next Chief Minister? Will it go down rather tamely, or will there be? Fissures in that as well when it comes down to whether it will be Mr. Siddharamaya or D.K. Sivakumar. Uh, visuals coming in from Bengaluru and the national capital. Visuals that the Congress is not very attuned to. It's after 2018 that they've seen such an emphatic win like they have this time around. So uh, 